नमस्कारम एवरी वन वेलकम टू द डे फिफ्टीन ऑफ फ्लो यात्रा इव इज अ वेरी ब्यूटिफुल स्टार्ट टू द डे एंड लेट मी टेल यू हाउ आई वर्क अप इन द मॉर्निंग एंड आई मेडिटेटेड एंड वाइल आई वॉज मेडिटेटिंग आई रियलाइज दैट हाउ मच माई हेड स्पेस मैंट टू मी my head space if not feeling right i don't want to become a bad person like i act all this uh, way that makes other people feel uncomfortable around me so even if i am not in a good head space i want to be a friendly person a friendly looking person so for that Uh, there are a couple of things that uh, I realized, and I took a note of it, which I want to share with you. And this is something really magical. Listen to me very carefully. So, when this thought came to my mind, which said, "I am angry, I am sad, I am happy, I am hungry." I am not any of these emotions. I am not anger. I am not sadness. I am not hunger. I am me. It's just a thought that came to my mind which passed from T minus 1 to T plus 1. There was a thought in between that thought I had this feeling that I'm feeling angry. I'm feeling sad I'm feeling hungry I'm feeling painful and that in that moment of time that thought passed and it got over I am not that emotion and the the more and more I attach myself to that emotion I start becoming that identity and that's how I realized that even even when even when we are thinking about uh, i'm feeling low on energy i'm feeling a low on uh, my myself i'm feeling low on uh, i'm feeling high on i don't know food all these comparisons that we do is in the form of a duality and and in 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 truth I'm not searching uh, towards duality. I'm searching for this single path of wellness. Like I just want to stay fit. I just want to stay healthy. I just want to walk on one singular path. And always the mind is juggling between two things. I'm on this road. I'm on that road. I'm on this road. And that confusion was starting to clear, uh, clear up from my head. once i translated all the duality all the duality to singularity let me tell you how so let's say i'm uh i'm feeling that i want to go to nepal next year and i want to be able to climb a mountain right simple and that thought just came to my mind and i'm just observing that thought and then i got a feeling that i am not fit to do this and just then i realized i don't want to call it unfit i just want to maintain my thought process around fitness that my current level of fitness is here and i want to increase the level of fitness to this and that's all that matters I don't want to call myself unfit. You understand? So that kind of uh, conversion of duality to singularity cleared up so much confusion from my head that just when I woke up from my meditative state of mind, I I realized that life is always good. There is a certain level of goodness and then that level of goodness is uh, to increase that level of goodness you go from here to here but if life is not that great then the level of goodness is here life is never bad and that moment 
I I was so so happy to know that I will never never look back on my life thinking that I did something bad I did not achieve something so I the two things that I learned which I'm going to carry with me for a very long time the first thing is that I am not the emotion I'm never going to attach myself with the emotion separate separate mari I am I am still learning who am I I'm still challenging that thought who am I but I am not the emotion that separation is the key and that comes with practice and the next thing that i learned was how to translate the duality into singularity if i'm having a thought which makes me feel that these are the two opposite things i'm going to convert it into one thing and put it on a level meter like a level meter level of freedom level of whatever call it something that helps you translate that duality into singularity and with this I'm going to see you tomorrow in the day 16 of Flow Yatra because tomorrow I am going to attend something which is so cultural rich. It's full of uh, uh, full of uh, surprises. I don't know what I'm going to see tomorrow, but to give you a hint, I am going to attend a Catholic marriage in a very small village in Wayanad, and thanks to my travel. I met a friend on the way where I connected with him and uh, when I was in his city I gave him a call I asked him where are you brother do you want to meet and he said brother you call me at the right time because I am here at my cousin's wedding and you can come and enjoy this wedding you can see this wedding it's going to be a once in a lifetime opportunity where I get to see this so I'm going to see you tomorrow at the wedding at day 16 of flow yatra signing off rohan washest hey